everybody and welcome back to part 5 of this Portal 2 in VR series. This is my third recording session and I'm hoping to be able to get all of the game or part of the game uh, done today. But right now we are just about to get out of this underground part of Old Aperture and <laughs> that is insane. That we're gonna be all the way up there, but first we do have to find how we can get up there. But thank you for everybody who's still sticking with these videos. Uh, it doesn't get as many views as the first video, obviously, but uh, I'm glad you guys have stuck around and decided to watch a whole series. And um, let me know if there's any other uh, like VR mods that you guys are interested in me playing or something else portal related, because uh, I love that kind of thing. But without further ado, let's begin. So, GLaDOS was just rambling about not having a plan and us trying to get out of here, so I guess that's what we're gonna do. And this is <laughs> gonna be a bit crazy, but we can just kind of launch ourselves here as long as we're on the platform. Three, two, one! Woohoo! <laughs> oh. Okay. Get the gel going. Interesting. Okay. Now we gotta bounce up there. Come on, potatoes. Let's turn that. Oh, fun portal. I don't want to turn into mash right now. Let's go. Whee! Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna use all three gels up here as well. Ugh. Oh, I'm so glad I'm back doing this. Woo! So, I, I feel fine. My Portal 2 VR legs are sound right now and I'm just always thrilled to be able to do this now let's get this gel here let's get this speed gel now it's quick oh not crooked okay Ooh. yes all right and I remember this taking me a while to figure out the first time, but pretty simple once you know what to do. All right, now we're gonna do the full triple bounce, yeah. All right, three, two, one, and... Yeah, no. Three, two, one, and go! Woohoo! Woo and clip through the pipe. I still don't know why they left that pipe in there, because like every time I've done this, I've clipped through the pipe. I'm not even sure where it leads. But, wow. Okay. Now, as if we didn't climb high enough already. Now, oh boy, okay, so this part's gonna be a bit harder, I imagine, than normal because of, like this part's always confusing, regardless of it being in VR, but now, it's gonna be even more <laughs> disorienting, Ooh, and that's how far we came from, alright. Let's see what's up here. Okay. Now we gotta climb up here somehow without slipping. Uh, and there. I can uh, see what's the crouch button. Oh no. Uh, 
Give me a second. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Okay. Oof. Now we just gotta activate the third switch. Which is over here. Woo! Oh no! Uh, I didn't aim it properly. And go! Yeah. Okay, alright. Good to know, Gladys. Hmm, not quite sure if that'd work on ChatGPT, but, you know, you can always hope. Yes. And... It actually leads to something. Freedom. And now we got gels working. Okay, now we gotta get down there. I know a way. Da 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 Get to the exit! Bring me up! I agree. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, you ever listen to what you're saying, so... It's pretty good. This section is also really, really neat. Remember another mod, uh, a portal mod, showed like this in-between section of old and new aperture? It was similar to this. It's always, it's always nice. Just eerie. It's that liminal space between the old 80s and the new, uh, actually furnished parts of aperture. I'm a bit short <laughs> than before, but that's okay. Uh, no, this is my average size. Because I can still reach the handlebars. Alright, so now we gotta face Weedum again. I hope he's uh I hope he's doing well and that when I come back he'll see exactly how much of a nice person I am and it's just gonna give me a ride back. Since he abandoned me earlier. For God's sake, your boxes with legs. It's, it's literally your only purpose. Walking onto buttons. How can you not do the one thing you're designed for? Can I get us down there? I'll hit him with a paradox. Warmer. Warmer. Boiling hot. Boil. Okay, colder. Colder. Ice cold. You're Arctic now. It's, you're, I, I, I don't cold. think they're colder. Very, very cold. Look, at all, actually. Oh, that's funny, is it? Oh, it's funny, because we've been at this for 12 hours, and you haven't solved it either, so I don't know why you're laughing. You've got one hour! Solve it! Now, I don't think he treats uh, his robots nicely, because GLaDOS does that. She treats robots nicely, right? So, that's why, that's why it's wrong. Hello! Hi, hi dude. Why is this turret as tall as me? Why? Like, that's awful. That is truly awful. You see these little pincers here? That's about as long as my arm. It's crazy. Alright. You did it! Hello! False. Um, true. I'll go true. Yeah, that was easy. I'll be honest, I might have heard that one before though. Sort of cheating. This is a big screen. Uh, false. I'll go false. Explosion imminent. Evacuate the facility immediately. Hold on, I feel like fix that. 
Warning. Reactor four is at critical. Well, I'm glad he's fixing stuff. So. Hey, it is great seeing you guys again. Seriously, um, it turns out I'm a little bit short on test subjects right now, so this works out perfect. And off we go. Uh, yeah, yeah. Actually, no, I'm not gonna disintegrate you. You're too cute. I love the Franken turrets. You have no idea what it's like in this body. I have to test all the time, or I get this this itch. You know, it must be hardwired into the system or something. Oh, but I tell you, when I do test, oh, oh man alive, I, nothing feels better. It's just, oh, just that's what I'm gonna test. That's what I'm gonna test. Wheelies. Uh... So you're gonna test, and I'm gonna watch, and everything is gonna be just. Warning. Core overheating. Nuclear meltdown imminent. Yeah, is there a nuclear reactor in Aperture Science? I didn't know that. I felt like I should have known that. It's a little bit difficult. You'll notice the moat area there. Very deadly. Extremely mm -hmm. dangerous. Eventually, it's dead. Not at the moment, but we'll, I'm working on it. Still working on it. Uh, uh-huh. Oh, oh <laughs> it almost landed. On the corner. Oh, well done. Oh, Maybe these walls are different. Tremendous. Hi, me. Alright. Uh, what if I take it off? Yeah, you're not done yet, are you? Still gotta get through the door. Need to get through the door there. Alright. Oh, it says test there. Oh, now it's a test. Oh, that felt really good. Oh, here's an idea. Since making tests is so difficult, why don't you just keep solving this test? To be fair, making tests are difficult. And I can just, like, I've tried before. Solving. Yeah, that, that sounds much easier. Here we go. Now, do it again. Uh, I forget. I, I don't know how I'm supposed to do this again. Do I stand on the button? See, if I stand on the button, then I can't do it. Also, why can I... I can hear the turret in there. Uh, false. I'll go false. Take that, Wheelie. I was nothing but nice to you before, and now you're just gonna absolutely. Okay, new tests. New tests. Gotta be some tests around here somewhere. Here we go. He's just gonna ridicule me after I was so nice to him before. Hmm. Yeah, test building is hard. I've tried to make my own. I haven't in years. But I do know it's hard to make a test that works well. And is fun. Good. I just invented some more tests. Not entirely, not entirely. Look at the little tests there on the wall. That's brand new. Oh, true. Brandings is everything, really. Uh, but yeah, the funnels. Yes, I love them. Now let's see how they are in VR. Whoa. Yeah. Okay, uh, 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 this way. Woo. Yeah, I'm in space. Oh, can you imagine how cool it's gonna be whenever I go, I do the space cutscene? Oh, that's gonna be so, so fun. All right, now let's put Q on the button, which is here. That's gonna be so cool, though. The whole space and Wheatley oh, scene. Oh wow! <laughs> well done. Seriously, both Chat, of you. Shut up. Yeah, you kind of regret making tests that can kill you now, huh? I mean, at least you're testing for uh, the glory of humanity? I don't know. I don't know why you're testing. Uh, it's kind of a dumb yeah, excuse. I made this test myself out of smaller tests that I found lying around. Jammed them all together. Buttons, got the funnels, 
bottomless pits are involved. It's got it all. It's got it all. That'd be dynamite. Absolute dynamite. Woo! Alright, okay, this is taking too long, okay? Love it, I'm weightless. <laughs> That's a fair reason. But. Never mind. Never mind. Solve it yourself. You're on your own. I mean, maybe you're conditioned to not give answers, but I imagine your potato is not going to shock you if you try to answer or tell me what oh, the answer to the yes. test is. Well done. Thanks. All you had to do was pull that lever. What? Well, no. You pressed the button! Yeah, that was worth it. I'd do exactly the same thing, GLaDOS. Because I'm nothing but nice to Wheatley. Hmm. Don't start yet, don't start yet. Okay. You're not gonna believe this. I found a sealed off win. Hundreds, hundreds of perfectly good test chambers. Just sitting there. Filled the skeletons, shook them out. Good as new. Ah. These ones are so cool. And now let's see it crack. Oh, that's more than I remember. And there we go. To be honest, you can't even tell, can you? Seamless. Yeah, seamless. Okay. Now let's go across. Ooh. Because aerial face plates are better, but this is still pretty cool. I, I played better zero gravity games, so I'm used to doing zero gravity, not aerial face plate launching. Come here, come the no, no, <laughs> my baby. Okay, we're gonna do this again. Uh, don't ask what happened to your brother. Alright, have fun! Come here, come here. Oh, almost fell there. Alright, now you and me together, bud. Again, you are huge! As tall as me! Stop it! Oh, here we go. Here it comes. I'm glad you're so ecstatic, really. I think uh, Wheatley needs some better uh, sources of dopamine than testing. Serotonin. Maybe he has ADHD. All right. So that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil is about obeying you. So Hi, let's try your way. All right. Fatty, adopted fatty. Hey. Fatty, no parents. That's a good joke. What? What's wrong with being adopted? What's wrong with being adopted? Uh, well, um, lack, lack of parents. Of parents. And also, nothing. But so, well, some of my best friends actually are orphans. Oh, for uh, no, you can't just say I have friends who are orphans. Hey, just do the test. Just do the test. Not quite senior. Now it is. Yeah, we'll just pull out the. Uh, I have friends who are orphans. Alright. Like, you know one orphan, you know them all? No, that's not, that's not true. It's not enough! If I'm such a moron, why can't you solve a simple test? I am solving the test. I think you just don't know... You don't understand your own emotions, really, and you need better coping mechanisms. I'm going through these chambers as fast as you can build them. Yeah, but I love this part of the soundtrack. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. 
pages being turned. Mm -hmm. So that was just what I was doing, just reading the uh, books. So no more. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one, Matthew Nelly. Do you oh. know what all the fuss was about? Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yeah. Yes. Well, on with the test. Which there was more books with us now. I have not read it, but I know it's it's tough. Um, but he's also a robot who can read anything given enough time. So, hey, now you do it. And I have a special goal for you, Mr. Franken Turret. Hit him. Oh, yeah. Okay, I thought that was gonna count for a second. Okay, stay there. Oh, you were? What science, Gladys? What science were you testing? Because I... Legally, or at least morally, you're supposed to share the results with the people that you're testing on. Hey, I'm in the psychology class right now. You're supposed to tell the patient. Maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results. What was that? Oh, sorry, we... I need to smash release monitor for a second. We oh, yeah. <laughs> Sure, sure. Oh, that's fun though. Like launching and then punching the <laughs> Wheatley's monitor. Gets so angry. Okay. Actually, I forgot, I need to launch this cube. That. Nah. Alright. Now, let's get down there. I'll get you eventually, Wheatley. You don't see me. Okay, we're gonna be quick about this. Three, two, one. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> All right. Now we're gonna go up here. Whee! And this. And try and launch you onto the button. And fail. It's okay. You don't see me. Are you are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I wonder. I'm talking it fast. Maybe there's a number of ways to solve them, and you're picking all the worst ways. No, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? Uh, you're you're missing some therapy, man. That's that's all I know. Idiots like you aren't supposed to get power that often. Or at least they shouldn't. Fulton core warning. Operator error exception has occurred at this. Um, fizz, 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 fizz reaction, but neutral multiplication rate at spike value 9999. Press any key to vent radiological emissions into atmosphere. That would not be nice. Consult reactor core manual for instructions on proper reactor core maintenance and repair. Yeah, you should read the manual more, Wheatley, because that helps. Didn't read the Spanish one either. Have a great way. I'm going to take you solving these and then watch 10 at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related note, I am going to need you to solve these 10 times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a way. Would you okay, you uh, I might be able to do that. Oh. Okay, let's go. Ooh. Uh, wait, this isn't right. Okay. I thought it was for a second. Also, I never noticed this. This wall is uh, angled based off of the... Oh, and you can kind of fall there. Yeah, 
It's little details that you don't really notice, or this pipe coming through. It's one of the coolest chambers. I, I just love the uh, details of it. Now, what I really want to do is this. So I can get super high and then launch myself. Woohoo! Alright, let's get off this angle. And let's block the laser. Perfect. No! How dare you? What, you can just walk around on two legs? Right. Also, it's kind of wasteful to put two, cur two turrets in one cube. Okay, you only need one. One has three legs and you put two with a leg each. Doesn't make sense. Okay. Like, I, I just don't look around enough when I play this game, man. But now I do because this is amazing. Just look at the expanse. All right. Now's not your turn. That was a good turn. Schrodinger's box. Uh, or no, not Schrodinger's box. I mean, uh, Chekhov's gun, but it's the box. If there's a laser cube, you always have to shoot a laser with it. You can't use it for actual um, buttons. Oh, you can only use the laser cube for lasers. Okay. And since I basically know what to do, do this, this. Then this. Come on. Then lunch. Look how cool I solved it. I brought the cube back to its receptacle. Stop shaking me. Yeah, yeah, I believe that. He, <laughs> you know, wait. No, Wheelie's just kind of distracted. He's, uh, he, he's a bit procrastinistic. He's like, eh, re rebuild the nuclear core, anything like that. Nah. Was more self-destructing than already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor for all time's sake. Two, like one or two more tremors in there, just for fun. That guy did. I let him keep his job, I'm not a monster. Well, you know, Gladys doesn't even do that, so I guess, you know, props to Wheatley. He probably just couldn't figure out how, but, uh, yeah. So you're telling me the announcer is an actual robot, like Wheatley? That's funny. I never actually noticed that. It's not a pre-recorded message, it's just straight up a robot. Okay. So now, I'm not gonna die by a laser. Okay, now I gotta catch the cube. As I look down into the pit, ooh, that's a huge logo. But awesome, love the branding. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Actually, I didn't need to get... I didn't need to get back up here. Give me a second. I didn't need to get back up here, but, uh, you know... Whatever works. Actually, I do, because I needed to... Actually, I did, so I can uh, actually knock it off this platform. Like this. Ooh. That's close. Wait a second. Okay. So I was partially right in some ways and partially not. So now, oh God. Might die. Did not die. Thank you, lag spike. Appreciate it. Okay. And. 
that works. Sorry, I just need to keep it exactly there. There we go. Out, out of service because it melted. Where is it? I wish I could see it. It doesn't even look like there should be a lift here. But well, pretty. Right. <laughs> That's crazy. I don't know why either. You gotta do a bit more than that. Hey, they got little eyes under here too. We'll deal with it. Whoa! Yeah, just uh, getting a uh, test ready for you, obviously. Who else That's not no suspicious. So, let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. There is no exit. Not a problem. I'll just I'll make an exit for your test. I mean, you don't have to have an exit. Hey. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hi. Come here. Come here. We can test together. Oh. Perfect. There you go. I'll be honest. After you told me to turn that beam off, I thought I had lost you. We're poking around for other test subjects. No, not there. Everyone's still dead. Oh, I did Makes find sense. something. Though. Reminds me, I've got a big surprise for you two. Uh. Oh God. All right. Just gotta activate this as that kind of cleans itself over there. That's nice. Uh, and I also need to activate this, so I need a cube. Appreciate the catch. I guess, uh, robots help each other out, since everything is sentient here, and it should not be. Go. Now we get to use the gel in the funnel. And go. Perfect. And now I have to catch myself, which is not scary. First, I have to activate the funnel. And then I can catch myself. And this is going to go right the first time with no problems. Whatsoever. Alright. Alright. Three. Two. Okay. Wait for the lag. Three. Two. One. Go. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> if I had a nickel for every time I had a dream right before I was about to jump a gap with speed gel and I died, I'd have two nickels. Which is kind of weird. But anyways, let's go. You two are gonna love this <sighs> First try. You might say you're going to love it to death. Love it until you until it kills you to your death. <laughs> Alright, I don't know whether you're uh, you're picking up on what yeah. I'm saying there. But... Yeah, I, I get it. Oh no, Wheatley's gonna try to kill me like he would he wouldn't hurt a fly. Obvious. I've done nothing wrong to him. All right. Yeah, can I grab you? No. Almost jumped down into the gap. Yeah, poor, poor guy. He didn't deserve that. Only three more chambers to your big surprise. Only three more chambers. 
Well, I better hurry up then. So I can die quicker, I guess. Theoretically, best course of action would be to not solve these puzzles, but, you know. First, give myself some gel. The next, give myself some more gel. Oh, okay. Hey, I'm only getting scraps. This is not how it should go. Especially when I almost died. Hi, don't mind me. Please don't mind me. Krish. And you're not gonna die. Go back. Go back where you came from or so help me. Okay, feeling better. And... Bye bye! Uh, very satisfied. Okay, so now, okay, I press this button, and activate this. Now we can get across. Let's go for the big jump. Woo! Oh, yeah. Good. Good. Yes, I. Oh, I couldn't even check. Whoa. 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 That's fun. Uh, phew. I don't know what he found. Maybe if somebody built like two robot test subjects in that way that you never have to test on the human again and could therefore kill all the humans, maybe it'd be there. Well, you're both dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, a bit, yeah. Only two more chambers. Two more chambers. Cool. Alright. Huh. I don't remember how to solve this chamber. I guess I'll jump at the same time as this one. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh! Oh no. Oh yeah. I think Gladys compliment. Why is it sunset underground? Uh, probably a nuclear explosion. Here's fair. What? This, this is the part where he kills me. This is the part where I kill you. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. White goop on me. No. Uh -uh. Ooh, ooh. That that could have been me. Escape. Bye. <laughs> no. Okay. Actually, what what do you want? What do you want? Yeah. Ask me. You know, whatever, I, I don't care anymore. No. No, I thought you were gonna say something interesting. <laughs> I still don't know why he's doing this. I did nothing wrong. Exactly. We were friends. I don't know, but I'm gonna fall now. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going. Ugh. Hey, buddy! Now we got a friend. Oh, oh, oh! I'm sorry. I'm already playing a game. Wheatley, I already did some cardio with you. Why are we doing cardio again? I don't want to hold on. Oh. Oh god. Please, please don't fall on my head. Eek. Yeah. 
Okay, why not? Hello! Y did you miss me? Here, you're probably the same one as before. Hey. Now we got a friend. Oh, we got. Almost fell. Oh. Well, there's the real turrets. Oh, that's a fun. They're all full houses. Shoot me. Uh, let's let's do a little little prank on Wheatley here. No. Okay. So as I was, as I was saying, we're gonna do a little prank on on Wheatley now. We're gonna do this. Yeah. Clever. Very clever. No, wait, come back. I'm sorry, please. No, I was going, I was going somewhere with all that. Oh, uh, okay, okay, fine, fine. Fool! You were oh. a fool to come back because I'm I was a fool? And again, not playing along. You're ruining what are some really good speeches, actually. Didn't uh, well, let me try again. The puppet master. You're a puppet in a play. Uh, no. I'm, I'm not a puppet, really. I'm sick of this. Fine, I just wanted to see you talk about cards badly again. Uh oh. I'm sure this will be fine. Is it Machiavelli? Oh, okay. Good, good. Finally, a nemesis worthy of my past. Okay. Well, we're home, home strut. In the home stretch. I don't think you faced that. Uh, technically, I am in VR, but ah, no, 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 no. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. Ah. Uh. We just installed those pipes. Guess I have to jump. Don't die until you get back? Okay, well at least he doesn't want to kill me then. Let's see what we can do about this. Beautiful. Goodbye. Unless I miss. Goodbye. Sweet dream. Have good night. And there. Goodbye. Have fun, turret. Okay. Now I'm just gonna put one there, just for fun. Oh yeah, I forgot, it's not fun, because you gotta crouch. Alright. Now I'm safe. Wahoo! <laughs> Sounds good. Apparently, based on the game's release, that uh, Wheatley should be dead, I think, this year. <laughs> if GLaDOS does this plan. Okay, more bombs! See the texture kind of clip into the other one? But, bombs away! Yay! Right, who knows when uh, GLaDOS started making bombs? Since obviously Wheatley didn't make it. Hey! What the hell? 
There might have been somebody living in there. Tower collapse. Yeah, who knows what? It, I'm sure the reactor core is over there. Because if it was the sun, it'd be up here. But no, it's this way. The, the reactor core is blowing up. The, the, that's all that is. All right. Now we're gonna do what we learned from old aperture and run and jump to get what we want. Okay. Go 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 go. Yeah. <sighs> In the final hours, goodbye. Ah. Oh my god, I, I haven't seen. How have I not noticed this? All of these towers just crumbling around. How have I not noticed? It is beautiful. Okay. Let's do this. Wheatley? Weedum, or should I say? Has no idea what's coming. I am going to beat him up so hard that he's gonna regret trying to be nice with me. Got it. <sighs> We're gonna beat up Wheatley so bad, it, he's, it's gonna be so much worse than just me smashing him against the wall. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do stuff to him, man. Potato power! Yeah. Yeah! Take our lemons back. Oh, hi. Hi, Wheatley. Oh, oh my gosh. It's huge. I have to fight this guy. Oh, okay. I'm not sure if I have three minutes, uh, so can we wrap this up? It sounds like me at the start of my YouTube videos. No portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. It's fine, I'm I'm allergic. Bomb me. Wow. Yeah. That's sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. But then I wanted you to trick me into breasting. Get you. <laughs> yeah. Where's the coin? Where's the coin? There you are. Come here, space corner. Michael. Where's the space guards? I don't know. I don't space guards. Get him. Warning. Core corruption at 50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four minutes. Yeah. I don't know. Aha! Okay, 
Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Also up there. Don't, don't talk to me that way. What, are you fighting that guy? Yeah. Get under control, you know, because there's a lot of stuff on the fire. Hey, oh. countdown clock. Man, that is trouble. Come on. Situation's looking pretty. Warning. Core corruption. You're going to feel like such an idiot after all these cores put on you. Timer. Destroy. Reactor explosion uncertainty. Emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! Uh-oh. I told you not to put these cores on, but you can listen, do you? Uh oh. Come on. Come on. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Uh oh. There. Last core. Where are you, fat core? Yeah. Come here. Um, speed drill somewhere. Before this, someone had to remain in the car at all times, driving in circles until passengers returned from their errands. I'm gonna get you. Come here. Ah. All right. Ooh. Hell yeah. Take that, Weedum. You're 100% corrupted. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Are you ready? Oh, interpret it. Fine. Yeah, that was some deep water. I'm pressing it. I'm doing it. I don't care. <laughs> oh, God. Ooh. Yes. I'm gonna do it. Goodbye, Weedum. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, oh my god, I gotta look up. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna hit you so hard, Weedum. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, Weedum. Hi! Oh, you're so cute. I have this happy body. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what you like. <laughs> I'd like to just sing. Yeah, I've never died. Hi. Right. What? Yay! I won the game. Bye, GLaDOS. I'll miss you. 
So this whole cutscene, I can just do. Or no, I can't. Man, ah, uh, that sucks. But oh, wow, this was an amazing experience. All right, I'm gonna turn my volume down here. Although you know, this is a very nice song. You can you can watch it later. But uh, this whole game, getting to experience this in VR like this, was so amazing. Obviously, it's not perfect. Like the last cutscene wasn't exactly what what I was thinking, but it's still like really cool that I was able to have this opportunity. This is something I've been wanting to do for years. I think like one of the first reasons I wanted a VR headset was to play some kind of portal VR game that came out. Um, it was like a short portal VR game, but I've always wanted to get into VR mostly because of this, uh, this game. And yeah, it, I'm definitely going to do this again. I'm not going to upload it, but I'm, I'm going to play this again at some point because the aerial face plates are so fun. The gels are so fun, like, launching yourself from the portals, it's not, it's not naughty. It's, it's really fun. But, climbing up now, yeah. I hope they release some of the mods, uh, or like, the Portal 2 mod can be used to play other mods like Portal Stories now. So I would love that. But, yeah. Now we're free. The big abyss of wheat. Yeah, I hope I hope you guys enjoyed the series. Like, I had a really good time. I got to see details of Portal Two that I've never seen before. Um, okay, apparently the credit scroll is attached to my face, so I can't read it. Uh, not perfect, but. <sighs> Wow. Yeah. Uh, always, if you if you guys still want to play this version, if you have a VR headset of your own, the link is in the description, uh, or you can find sources online. But this and the Half Life Two VR mod are are really cool, and I, I'm just in awe that not only how great this is, but also that Valve decided not to make this them, themselves, but it still got made. It's still great. Um, yeah. Wow. I, I still plan on making some more Portal content on my channel. I, I'm probably going to make some more Wheatley videos or maybe even my own like animation not based on any voice lines, like a sequel to Portal type of animation. Uh, just because I love this game series. But... Yeah, uh, and I'll end this off whenever the uh, the last animation of Wheatley plays. Hello, Editor Jack here, and I just wanted to say that July 7th, which just passed, marks the 10-year anniversary of me playing Portal 2. And so I think this video is just a great way to send off the past 10 years of me playing this game, loving this game, and just really delving into all the fun parts about this game and like this game portal 2 is the reason why i got steam as well this is my 10 year anniversary on steam and allowed me to get dozens uh specifically 86 games <laughs> on steam that i've just enjoyed and had such an amazing time on this platform so yeah portal 2 has made a big impact on my life. Thank you all for joining me in what I think is the first full playthrough of Portal uh, Portal 2 VR uh, on YouTube. Or at least the first one that I've seen. So, yeah. i really glad I could show you guys what this experience is like for me, as well as just the visuals, um, even if you can't really grasp the sense of scale as well uh and i hope i was entertaining and uh yeah i i really do hope valve does 
actual more stuff into VR uh, like they did with Half-Life Alex. I, I don't think uh, they should abandon it. They should keep making stuff like that. So, so yeah. Thanks for watching. The end. Circumstances have been shockingly nice. You want your freedom.